Hello everyone and welcome to a new PS Vita video and we are looking at the stock app remover. This is a new utility that was introduced back in September of 2021 created by Ant HJ and this utility basically removes those stock applications like parental controls, party, welcome park, those apps that we really don't use. I don't use them personally. And I'm very happy to see that someone has created something like this for us. And this will not completely remove those applications. It will just hide them. So if you wanted to, uh, let's say, go back into parental controls or uh, get your messages going again, you just go back into the application and you select the app and then reboot your system. Very easy to use. Uh, it starts right away. All you have to do is just select all the apps you want to hide and then you press start and it should reboot. So you can download it right now through the Vita Homebrew browser or the better Homebrew browser. So let's go and check it out. I'm very excited to be creating content again just got my new glasses they're pretty big but uh, very happy with them uh, here it is stock app remover beautiful wallpaper there by ant hj thank you so much for your hard work and dedication vita homebrew browser let's hit ok to close that app so here's the interface very basic and simple and select your apps to hide show then press start to save and reboot so right now we have the ps4 link blocked or hidden and if i press x it will give us a big big old lie <laughs> so let's remove that one let's go to parental controls let's do party i do need browser welcome park do need friends messages I don't really do photos, nor do I do near, calendar, email, uh, let's see, music. I really don't listen to music on here. And then if I do want to listen to music, I'll use the Homebrew app application for that. So yeah, reset all bubbles currently to visibility. Interesting. So yeah, we will hit start, save it, and reboot. So before we do that, I'll show you what I got going on. So here are my stock apps. I usually have them at the very top. There's email, near, folders. What's this one? Oh, I, was, I guess I had to restart creating uh, my folders there. I never got around to finishing it. So this is what you see here. And let's continue on the save and reboot. When restoring apps, they will fill the spaces on the same page, bubble folder as this app. All right, so here we are back on the home screen. And so these are in the folder, but there's nothing in there. I can't really select. Oops, yeah. So it does show. You can see how in that bubble, the party icon is in there, but when you go inside, it's not there. So yeah, that's pretty nice. Or if we can move that here, move that there. And then we can move this here. So we have the, the beautiful Samus all in the center there very good so yeah that's basically it for that app cleans it up a little bit very nice glad to see someone has worked on something like this for those stock apps because they are kind of obnoxiously annoying and just sitting there wasting some space so yeah there you go guys that is it for this video let me know in the comment section what you think so thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you enjoy my content don't hesitate to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything like this in the future. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you on the next one.